Hello Scorpio, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of March 2nd through the 9th, 2020. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish and I'm closing off with my Fountain Tarot by Jonathan Saints. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Scorpio? Scorpio, 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 what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got the Visions card reversed here. I do feel like somebody's getting signs. Somebody is very intuitive. Stop it, girl. I do feel like somebody is not um, listening to their self, not listening to their visions, okay? All right, so we got the siren of the song. I feel like somebody's not listening to their visions, and they're not listening to um, people around them, family and friends, okay? All right, so we got the future fate card here. So this makes me feel like... Um, Somebody's trying not to look at something because they think it's going to make it not happen. Okay, of course it's going to happen anyway. But I do feel like somebody's trying to avoid the truth here. All right. Okay, so we got the vulnerability card reversed here. So here, I usually don't see this card like this. I do feel like somebody may be taking advantage of you. Okay. Um, yeah, you, you're not seeing it. Okay, you're seeing it, but you're just like, no. I'm overreacting. Your friends are overreacting. Family is overreacting. Okay, but I do feel like somebody is taking advantage of you. I feel like it's emotionally and materialistically, physically. Okay. Okay, yeah. We got the masculine divine. I do feel like this person is a very arrogant, aggressive. Um, I do feel like this person is doesn't take anything that you like or want serious okay it's just like uh whatever you say is just p more peas in a pod it's just nothing okay it's just there i do feel like this person you're dealing with um could be the other way around feels like only thing that's important only thing that it matters is them them and what they got going on okay that makes sense so we got the telepathy card here to me this makes me feel like you feel one with this person but i also feel like most of all it's the grown-up activity that's making you feel like you don't care about anything else okay it could be another way around too it's just like uh whatever this person do as long as the grown-up stuff happens around that time you know it just all goes away Okay, so I do feel like somebody is just trying to enjoy this thing while it lasts, okay? All right, let's keep going. All right, so, yes. So we got the letting go card here. So this makes me feel like somebody, girl, get off my lap. Somebody is just letting everything go, letting this person do what they want to do um, just for the grown-up activity, okay? Okay. It's just like, as long as you're giving me what I want, you can do whatever you want. I don't care. All right. All right. So we got the reflection cards here. I do feel like somebody is looking at what happened, but I do feel like somebody is trying not to see it for what it is. Okay. But I do feel like there's getting ready to come a point where it's just going to come flat out. You're not going to be able to ignore whatever is getting ready to happen. You're not going to be able to ignore it. Ignore it. Okay. Whether you do something about it, that's a whole nother story. But it's just going to be like, wow, this person is flat out. All right, so let's see what's going on with these Fountain Tarot deck. All right, what's going on with the Scorpio? Scorpio love reading for March 2nd through the 9th, 2020. Already a quarter way through the year, y'all. Crazy. Crazy. All right, what's going on? The Scorpio. Sorry. <laughs> what's going 
going on? What's going on? What's going on? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. All right. All right. So we got the five of coins reversed here. So I do feel like somebody was just putting all the effort, putting all the care into this situation. But I do feel like it was all going to waste. I do feel like whatever this thing is, is getting ready to happen. I do feel like um, somebody is getting ready to start reserving some of their time and money from this person, okay? All right, so we got the Five of Swords here. Wow. Okay, so this makes me feel like, you know, the person was being disrespectful. I am... Man, hear me roar or whatever. I do feel like somebody's feeling like I'm the king of the world or queen of the world, whatever. Um, and I do feel like at one point this person assumed that they can do just anything to you. They disappeared. This person took off. And I do feel like this person, if they didn't just leave, I feel like they just went in your wallet, took all your money. Okay. And then went and blew it. Okay, and then came back like nothing was going to happen, okay? I do feel like this caused a issue. This definitely caused a fight between you guys, all right? All right, so we got the King of Swords reversed here. So I do feel like uh, this person is very, I want to say, st strategic, okay? So it's like grown-up stuff, steal your money. Spend it, buy one thing for you, and then come back thinking everything is going to be okay, okay? This person is definitely um, a manipulator. This person is a thief, okay? This person is con artist is the perfect word for this person, okay? Definitely a con artist. All right, let's see what's going on. But this person just take and take and take. All right, so we got the King of Wands here. So I do feel like you are very emotional um, when it comes to this person. But I do feel like you per you got this person had a space. This person can do what they want to do, say what they want to say, just go be free, and you just um, let it happen. I do feel like you just, it's like as long as you're doing for me, I don't care what you do, okay? That's the kind of energy. And then I do feel like you're putting up that loyal um like that loyal character like okay as long as you be there for me you know i'm gonna be there for you but now this person is taking without asking and it's 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 it's, it's causing problems okay okay we gotta see what that is after we see what this other thing is okay so i can see that card from here i don't want to start talking about it yet so chariot so this my this dude or woman <laughs> um wow so uh, i do feel like they they did it quick it was just like okay grown-up stuff getting a shower and next thing you know you come out they go and so is your money okay that's the kind of situation that happened when this person did whatever they did or disappeared when they disappeared i do feel like it was just out of the blue it was quick now i do feel like no response was given but when this person came back they had something for you okay um, mm, mm, mm. so we got the emperor card reversed here. So this makes me feel like the person you're dealing with is definitely unstable emotionally, physically. And I do feel like this person is like at a lower level at their job or don't have a job at all. Okay. My dog is trying to jump out the door. So I'm going to have to uh, take her for a walk after this. <laughs> all right, let's keep going. We got the king of swords reversed here. One card, please. All right, so we got the temperance card reversed here. So I do feel like, yeah, impatient. But I do feel like this is definitely going to make you mad, okay? You just go do something quick. And, and this person could have just been promising you grown-up stuff. You going to get ready, come back, they, they gone, okay? But I do feel like this is definitely going to make you furious with this person. And you, you're going to make a, a situation out of it, all right? Let's see what's going on with this king of wands and we gonna see what that is too all right seven of cups reverse so this makes me mm. all right so this could be a same-sex relationship um but this also makes me feel like somebody has uh to make a choice about what they're gonna do but they're not sure i'm not sure what i'm gonna do um this also makes me feel like 
somebody don't know if they should continue to be loyal to this person or, or let this person be around them, okay? So Ten of Wands, I do feel like somebody is starting to feel like this person is more of a burden than anything. And I do feel like somebody's thinking about, should I drop it? Should I drop it? So we got the Four of Swords reversed here. So um, this makes me feel like, yeah, after this person do it, they do. I don't feel like the re relationship will be recoverable, okay? Just because that was that's what this represents to me you know when you're thinking about something and you're like oh, no i can't go back because i can't leave my purse around this person i can't trust this person like i want to um but i do feel like somebody is trying to figure out what they're gonna do but it look like distrust in the end okay but that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching